What's up, y'all? Uh, another video today. Um, this video is uh, gonna be doing a little story time. Uh, why I decided to stay home after high school. Right, so, I, if you guys have been on the channel and watching my backstory, you guys would know that, you know, I've kind of been in the real estate business for going on four years right now. Um, and, you know, of course, you know, I'm in the Pensacola, Florida area. Um, with me being in Pensacola, Florida area, it's more so of a military town. So it's not really, it's very, very country and it's very, very, like, slow. Like, you know, for young teenagers or college kids, it's very, very, like, it ain't really much to do here. Um, and, uh, but back to why you know i'm making this video is i want to give you guys like a little insight on like why i decided to stay home versus you know moving out or uh going to college elsewhere versus just staying home so for me in my situation staying home was the better fit because i knew being in pensacola florida pensacola florida is not really like a a city for myself uh, personally, I, I, I'm used to living in big cities, so I've lived in big cities and I still travel to big cities like Miami, as you guys seen in the vlog. Um, but that, uh, those experiences kind of told, made me impl it implement it in my mind. It's like, bro, I never ever want to stay here in Pensacola because, plus, you know, I already have a house, no mortgage on the house or anything like that. So it's like, why, why stay here? I mean, I could always come back later when I'm older, but right now, nah, like, I gotta get to the bag, right? So, but one thing I noticed is, like, all my friends who actually moved out as soon as they graduated high school, um, you know, some people went to college, ended up having to come back home because college was too expensive. I knew I didn't want that to be me, so I was like, okay, uh, it's not finna be me, so if that's not finna be me, I, uh... Why not let me stay home, go to college. I end up getting a full ride at a community college, save myself a ton of money that way. Then, um, of course, while I was in high school, I got my real estate license. Well, I was went to real estate school, and then when I graduated, got my real estate license. So, I was, you know, my plan was to, you know, okay, let me stay at home, save some bread, save money on college, go to a community college. And that way, you know, I kind of build myself up and have, you know, cash flow coming in to where you know eventually when i'm actually ready to move then you know i can um make that decision but like I, the thing that i see like with a lot of people my age 23 and under is that um a lot of people like they they leave home too soon bro like leaving home just to be on your own a lot of people be trying to leave home just to be grown or to uh have kids or you know and, and it's rough out here, like, so, so, whoa, back what I was saying, you know, it's rough out here, uh, especially, like, you know, during the time that, you know, I graduated, I graduated, like, I graduated high school, like, six months before COVID happened, so, like, as soon as I was going to college, um, that's when COVID hit, and honestly, like, for me, personally, it's been hard for me to get a job, like, it's been hard for me to get a job since from 2019 till now. I'm 23 now. So, like, I've been independent. I've been, like, from the entrepreneur mindset. When I graduated high school, I had a, uh, a job at my school for a month. And at the time, I was making, like, $8 an hour. That was, like, pre-COVID. Yeah, so, like, pre-COVID, um, it was pretty kind of... Things are kind of rough, and even now, like you know, with it being twenty twenty three, I just turned twenty twenty three. It's uh, you know, technically we're in a recession right now, and it's still hard to find a job. So uh, I've never really like explained it on this channel, but I'm actually in like the tech space. I go, I'm right now. I'm going to school for IT and getting into the artificial intelligence and the crypto space, right? But I haven't been able to find a job within the past like three years. Um, have a ton of experience though, but like everything's really been all hustle and just, you know, my brand and stuff. So, you know, uh, 
y'all wish me luck, but that's actually why, you know, I decided to stay home. I feel like me staying home actually made my life a lot easier versus me trying to be grown and be on my own, this, that, and the third. Save so much money. I stash so much money, so it's like life is good for me. And um, staying at home allowed me to buy the car that I wanted. Um, it allowed me to do a lot of stuff. It allows me to travel all over the place, you know, just more so just get my mind right to where I'm not really stressing. The only things that I stress about nowadays is just reaching the levels of, of success that I have not reached yet. Those are my stresses. But, you know, I don't have to really worry about being homeless, this, that, and the third, right? But, yeah. But and, and for anybody watching this video who's actually younger or older and you're still at home, don't feel ashamed, especially if you are actually putting in the work that you need to be putting in. Now, if you just a bum and you just at home not accomplishing nothing or not going after nothing, then, you know, you need to get yourself together. But for the most part, it saves a ton of money. Um, anybody who's, um, if your parents allow you to stay at home right out of high school, I definitely support it. Or while you're in college, I definitely support it. Um, but be sure to, you know, always be working on your skill sets, working on, um, uh, things that will benefit you in the long run. That way, from once you do leave home, you're not, you know, struggling or anything. And last thing, I leave off with this. You know, in my culture, with me being Muslim, in the Muslim culture, they actually don't let you leave home until, they don't let the man leave home until he can actually buy his own house and um, stand on his own two feet. So that's actually something I think everybody should implement in their household. But yeah, hey. Hope you guys like this video. Like, subscribe, and subscribe.